Guess what I've been doing? Oh, just sorting this out, this lot. Got these, uh, got all the appliances scrapped out. Got the stainless off the doors. All the motors are out, alloy wheels. I mean, alloy wheels. Them ones. The good stuff. Just gonna get all this back in here. Gonna get weighed and paid just to get it all out of my van. It won't be much, it's not even half a ton in there. But we get it emptied anyway. Oh, I picked up a stainless steel stink. Good times. And another wheel. Right. Let's, uh, let's get this crap back in here. And go and get weighed and paid. up might as well go and see what we can find on the way still get a few more appliances in there and uh, yeah go and get weighed and paid it won't be much but at least it's something and we've got some copper motors to scrap that is indeed copper that one out of a washing machine which is amazing the other one was aluminium there's a couple more copper ones there as well so let's go and do that Laughing at all days. Go on, mate. Dumping it here for now, I think. Hey, chuck it out here, mate. Yeah, it's never going to work again, mate. Look out. <laughs> that thing got dropped from the flat, I think. She wrote. Oh, it's been weighed and paid. I kept a little bit of shearing on top on board so I didn't want to throw it off as light iron. I've got an alloy wheel there, a steel wheel, stainless. And these motors, most of these are copper, so I want to get the copper out of these. A bit of stainless there and a bit of aluminium. I think only one of them is aluminium. A few bits and pieces. So I'm gonna go home, mosey my way home, see what we can pick up. And uh 
Yeah, oh, I'll do Wayne Paid first, but uh, let's just get this tidied up quick, shall we? Yeah, let's do that. And there you go. All nice and tidy. There's the uh, Ford alloy. It's not a bad shape, actually. The tyre's knackered. Uh, there's a steel one underneath. Aluminium, bit stainless, more stainless. Wireage, motorage, uh, shearing edge, uh, bench edge with that edge. Gasps. Pretty good. It's just a shame I, uh, I bent it already. <laughs> oh, what? The dingle's missing. Oh, what the hell? Oh, where's that gone? Oh, I'll have to try and find that. Oh, well. I'll have to do for now. Well, I'm just going to have a little mooch around, see what's on the way home. But first, what did it weigh and what did it pay? So I just went in with 380 kilos of light iron at 155 pound a ton for 58 pounds and 90p. And that's it. So it was only... So from what you saw in my last video, we ended on Saturday at the scrapyard. And then I got a phone call as I was parked up here. Uh, to go and get a collection so i've done that i had another collection on sunday i went out to get milk yesterday uh, no this morning and i found a tumble dryer a dishwasher and a washing machine so that was pretty much what's in the back so yeah that's it 60 quid for doing very little to be honest with you um yeah but let's go and get a refreshing drink somewhere and uh see what we can find on the way home and i can sort all this crap out in the back Bench down there. I'm gonna have a little butchers. I think I cut the cord off that Hoover yesterday. Right. In the workshop, let's try and uh, take this, make this one apart. Done a few before. It's brass. Spring's gone on me bloody snakes, but what's a load of rubbish? Magnet. And then it's pretty much just a bit short still there. You just left with that, which I believe is copper, but you need to cut the two ends off. So I'm just wondering it can it be done with a reciprocator? Let's find out, shall we? Right, never tried it before with this, I've never actually cut one of these up, so let's give it a go. a little bit more copper on that one. Let's, uh, let's clear the stuff off this table. Because it's getting warmer and softer. Oh, 
that is hot. It's worth all we had, right? Oh, and uh, you get that as well. A bit of brass. And, uh, a bit of copper. The rest is short steel and uh, magnets. Let's give this a quick whirl. It was tough. Short. Clean short. 235 pound a ton. Too noisy. It's just too noisy. Brute force one in the end. Sure. There's another bit over that. Can't just cut that. And it'll just slide out, right? Probably not.
Yeah. Not too bad. <laughs> Must be sure still. Very nice bit of short still. Make it look so easy on YouTube. Yes, I'll be honest with you. Sure. Well, that's it for this one, guys. Not a lot to write on about, to be honest with you. Two, three, four. Five motors. It's taken me quite a while. So we've got a couple more to do. It's all short steel, stainless, and aluminium. Let's go for it later. Haven't done that yet because uh, they took way longer than what I thought they would, and it's aluminium. Maybe I thought they were copper, but it turns out they were quite aluminium, look. The bastards. Motors. Yeah, that's it. I just need a much better setup. I need a workshop. There's a couple of kilos of copper there anyway for me hours work. What's that, 10 quid? Right, I'll find something to put that in. Right, I'm afraid that's it for this one. Get this tidied up, ready for the morning, and go out. So until then, be cool, be kind, and I'll see you next time on Vandal Vlogs. Don't forget to smash that pause up button. Cheers, guys. See you later.